Welcome to Behind the Music Desk, where we will be talking about the songs that we played on the 7 o'clock news. I'm Claire. I'm Lindsay. And I'm Ben. The first song we're going to talk about is Wild Child by Shopping. So, four important things here. Yeah. So they're they're punk. Got it. They're DIY. They're Brits. And they're a band. Four very important things to know about this song. The band part's key. The band part is key. And so basically this is super fun. It just, it, it's a bop through and through. And this is what would be playing in like, in a photo montage where teens in a movie are engaging in escapades. Yeah, they're pulling pranks, they're making mischief, and this song is going on in the background. Groovy's bass line I've heard all day. Oh yeah, yeah it is such a fun bass line. That was a really good impression of that bass line. That was incredible. And I just feel like the words wild child is flashing in my mind when when it when I when I hear it. Like wild child. And again, a, a sans serif font. There's no serifs in this font. Um, and it's great. This is just a wonderful bassy bop. Yeah, it's a great it's a great example of modern, like postmodern punk. The next song we played on news is uh, Need Your Love by Curtis Harding, which is another bop by the way. He, this song makes you want to dance, it makes you need to dance, and it yeah. makes you dance. Yeah. <laughs> Those were my three things about that song. All of them had to do with dancing. And I love it because it's like a song about needing love, but it mm. doesn't necessarily feel like a romantic song. It's just kind of like, it can be romantic, but it can also be like familial love or friend love. It's and more celebratory than anything. It's celebratory, yeah. yeah. For me, it, I definitely got like the Motown vibes, yeah. for sure. Mm -hmm. But you also said he's a he was a backup singer for CeeLo Green? Yeah, yes, he was yes. a backup singer for CeeLo Green. His mom was a traveling gospel singer. Amazing. She used to take him on the road with him, would take him on the road with her. Yes. It was a, a pretty, it was a, like a pretty crazy life, I'd imagine. Like, yeah, a lot of really interesting influences, and I, he calls his genre, um... Slop and Soul. Slop and Soul, which I love. Yeah. I love. Like, it's if like that a... were, like, if that were a restaurant, I'd go. You know, like, like if that were an album yeah, that'd be title, really good. Like, I, you know, I'm, I'm there. I just, yeah, it's just a fun song, exalting love, and I love that. Love to love, love. Love to love, love. It's beautiful. The next song, "Cool" by Soccer Mommy. The genre is bedroom pop, mm -hmm. which I just learned about today when I searched it on Wikipedia. <laughs> uh, I believe uh, the artist Soccer Mommy described it as chill, but also kind of sad. Yes. Yeah. Chill, but also kind of sad, that's you on, know? That's on her band camp. Uh, she, <laughs> <laughs> that's a description on band camp. Yeah, no, it's Chill, but also kind of yeah, sad. Which I think is a really good, really good description. And she's like 20 years old, and she's killing it. She's already made like three EPs. This is her first studio released album, and it's beautiful, but still kind of has that signature, like, bedroom, bedroom pop. pop vibe. Um, and the song's like about envy. And, you know, a relatable part of human experience. Yeah, especially like as a young person, I feel like envy is so omnipresent. Ubiquitous. Ubiquitous, yeah. She's uh this is her first studio album. She's going from her from her bedroom to the studio. Yeah. And so I think yeah. it's a it's a time where she's kind of tidying up her sound mm -hmm. and making it a a more I think a, a definitely more produced kind of music. Yeah. But is it still bedroom pop? If it's out of the bedroom, Ooh. probably. I'm gonna say yes. I mean, if you, I feel like if you write the song in your bedroom, <laughs> is it still bedroom pop? I don't know. That's a really good debate that maybe we need to have. Do you think we need to def start defining songs by where they were written? That's a, that's a really good point. I've never thought of that. Tour bus rock. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I'm there. Yeah. And speaking of uh, tour tour buses and, and rock, being there, <laughs> let's move on to nightclub of the vaccines. Uh, this is a new single from them, and uh, they were actually the first concert I ever saw when I came to Boston. That's crazy. Yeah. I was a little freshman, and it like What's blew my like? mind. What is that like? <laughs> Gosh, I barely remember. <laughs> remember just for sweet. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> freshman. Freshman amongst two seniors. <laughs> but yeah, no, it was a wonderful concert, and this is still like their sound, but it's definitely... Cleaner. More, it's cleaner. It's cleaner, and the the hook makes my makes my head feel like a nightclub. That can be either really good or really bad. It can Do go you, either way, depending on your stance on nightclubs. Like, like for, bad news to me. That, yeah, yeah it's like bad news to me. <laughs> it definitely sounds like it, it. It sounds like a complaint more than anything. Yeah, if you're yeah. if you're saying my head feels like a nightclub, I'm doubt you're like, and I feel great about it. 
Yeah. I doubt that's the next thing you say. Yeah. That would be a great end to the hook, though. <laughs> My head I feels feel nice. great about it. Yeah, and honestly, like, the hook literally sounds like what it would feel like to have your head feel like a nightclub. Like, Which is like, loud. It's like an onomatopoeia, but like a song. <laughs> like, like it's, it's just like, like how the song would feel and sound. For you, it, that's how it sounds. I mean, for you, I mean, that's just music. But like, <laughs> but it, but it feels like it feels like what he's saying, and that's so cool. And maybe that is just music. Maybe that is just music. It makes it makes you feel what you want to feel. Join us next week on Behind the Music Desk, where we'll be talking more about music, new music that is. Here on eight eight nine W E R S.